Uh, so Tim, it's a it's a frustrating one all draw against Birmingham this afternoon. Um, what are your instant thoughts on the result? Instant thoughts. It was a poor game. Um, played out in really difficult conditions in terms of you know there's a, there's a there's a wind. Pitch is real lively, bobbly. Uh, wind's dried it out a little bit. It was tough for the to for both sets to be fair to try and play too much football. Um, and it's one of those you know you get your noses in front, win the game, just win the game. I mean obviously the the goal we conceded in the what is it the fifth minute or whatever of overtime uh, added on time is, is calamitous to say the least I mean it's, it's just a bog standard straight one down the pipe and we just well, I don't really know what's happened so I look back at it but there's obviously no communication at the back it's the post and the mad reacts quick, quicker but uh, so it's a real kick in, the, kick in the stomach but listen I said to them you know they're in there like they've lost I said you know the, the positives are you're three unbeaten. You should have won. You should have seen it out. Obviously, we missed the penalty, which you know is a big, big opportunity or good save, whatever you want to call it. Um, uh, you know, listen, we 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 need to do better. There's no doubt about that. We need to do better. I'll uh, I'll watch it back tomorrow and have a think about how I set it up. Um, you know, whether I was right or wrong to do so. I changed changed the shape a little bit. Went to a back three. <clears throat> Did it work? Not massively. It smelt at half time. It smelt of them getting a goal on a counter attack. It was scrappy. They were sort of playing on the counter because we had the win with us in the first half and didn't really utilise it. Particularly, we didn't manage to get that territory and keep them keep them pinned in, which is what I was after. But listen, it is what it is. At the end of the day, we've been three games. We've had two wins and a draw. So I can't be too disappointed with their effort. Listen, make no mistakes. There's, there's a set of lads in there that are giving everything for the football club. I've tried to bring reinforcements in because. Clearly, three weeks ago we were in a bit of a precarious position. Results haven't gone for us today. You know, Sudbury win, Kettering win. I think I quickly looking Starbridge won. I think so. Listen, there's a few that are in and around us and below us that have won. So you know, they would have been two really important points that we've we've thrown away at the end. So we'll have a little think about it this week, couple of sessions, and and um, you know, I'll have a little think about what I'm going to do down there on uh, next week. Yeah, perhaps somewhat strange <coughs> we're playing Berkhamstead again next Saturday. So. What needs to be done so that we can take three points next time around? Well, listen, first of all, we need to take our chances. <laughs> that, that, that would be first and foremost. I, I thought our set plays were better today, better delivery, um, slightly better movement patterns. We had, we got one or two little half chances off those. We need to improve at those for sure. But again, it's, you know, I'm, I'm doing now what should have been done in pre-season or I would have done in pre-season. Every time we train with, we've been doing set pieces as well. Um, so I'm just using the sessions to try and bed them down, but it's not easy. Um, and obviously, you know, it's attracting players to, to the club because of obviously they look at the division and they also, it's this time of year, you know, I've got to look at that. They're, they're, they're available, why? Because they want top dollar or they're good enough. So, um, you know, we are where we are with that. So, yeah, I mean, listen, we need to improve. There's no doubt. Um, but a c couple of good wins and now... Um, a disappointing draw because of the fact that you're one nil up with a minute or so left on the clock and you don't see it out. So that's the thing that's disappointing. You know, I, if you said I don't know in terms of things, it looked like a 50-50 game to me. We got our noses in front with a great strike from Rowie, but I have a little look at it. Um, you know, I said to the boys, whatever you do, don't think these are going to come here and let you tickle their tummy. They won't. I've, I've seen them. You saw them. It's like they, they went potty at the end, didn't they, when they scored the goal and. You know, they're still in there throwing punches. I don't think their management team are going to let them down tools. Um, so, listen, yeah, we'll have to go down there and be solid and strong and take our chances, basically. But um, I'll have a little think about it. Cheers, Tim. Cheers, Cheers mate.